Man, don't you love the smell of Tuesday morning? Cause I smell an arm pump. My dudes, I'm about to walk you through my ultimate arm pump that I hit every Tuesday morning. We hitting back and buys tonight too. So double up on the arms. I know that probably isn't the best, but who cares? But I hit this arm pump every Tuesday because it makes it feel like Friday. Cause arm pumps are always a great day, my dudes. Let's run it up, let's start this one off with some hammer curls. This is what we're listening to today, Booty Mix Volume 8, let's get it. Starting this one off, we got some hammer curls with the 25s. We're going light on this first set just to warm up a little bit. We go some extra reps on this one, not gonna lie. Make the perfect arm workout. You gotta pair every bicep exercise with the tricep exercise, so we got some Tricep extensions right here. Man, my triceps are burning from last night. Not even gonna lie, we did chest and tries last night. Now that we're warmed up a little bit, we can move on to the 45s for some hammer curls. Four might be a little whack, but who cares, you're curling 45s. Back at it as quick as you can with the tricep extensions. Make sure you're being controlled on these bad boys. And make sure you still have count because I lost count. We're going four sets of 12 on this. And if you have lighter weight like I do, just make sure you control it more so it puts more strain on your muscles. Now I gotta put this stupid jacket back on to take the video of me taking the jacket off. So already it's too hot in here, so we're taking the jacket off. Woo! Oh, hammer curls time, baby. If you wanna, if you wanna go more than eight, just cheat them. Just cheat reps, baby. So if you were wondering what part of the bicep hammer curls hit, literally just take your dumbbell, hold it up like this, and feel what part of your bicep is the tightest. So the tightest part of my bicep is right here right now. And now we're gonna hit cross body curls. So the tightest part of my bicep is like right here and still on the inside. Don't worry, we're gonna get to the outer part of the bicep later. Okay, crossbody curls, let's rep it out. Four sets of eight on this too. <sighs> really thought that I was about to miss a tricep workout. No, paired up with crossbody curls, we got some military push-ups. I like those because it feels like on that push-up you are only hitting that tricep. Make sure those elbows are staying close to your rib cage so it's only hitting that tricep, only working it like so. Last year before the finisher we are hitting some skull crushers for, for four sets of 12 obviously, everything on triceps today is four sets of 12. But incline skull crushers, here we go. Remember when I said about 30 seconds ago we were gonna hit some regular curls? Well, the time is now. Ah, uh, let's get some regular seated curls for four sets of eight. Super controlled on this. Woo! Yeah, my genius butt paired up the only two exercises where you use a bench together. So, I'm gonna have to adjust that every stinking time now. Ugh, skull crushers though. It's a little bicep aesthetic time. Honestly, I couldn't even tell you why I filmed that clip. I thought my bicep was gonna look so much bigger, but in reality, I don't have big biceps. Last thing we're doing, grab that easy bar, and we are doing a hundred curls non-stop. And if you get tired on the curls, do a hundred tricep extensions, but you are not dropping this bar for all 200 reps right here. This is the finisher, so it's meant to literally just burn you out right here. Ow, God. Oh, I hit my chin. Also, when you get around 50 reps, your curls are gonna start looking like this. That is okay, those are cheap curls, uh, but yeah, I mean, it's all right. But really though, try and have good form for most of the curls. So your tricep extensions may also start looking like this. Uh, I know 100 reps is a lot, but my dudes, 
This is the finisher, so you just gotta give it your all. Like, my reps are not that good right now. Oh, I'm dying, I'm dying. Oh. This is what I do every Tuesday morning and Tuesday night. I will usually just hit back. Maybe throw a little extra bicep in there. Just depends on how I'm feeling though. But yeah, that is the Swoley Moly Arm Pump Guide right there. Full walkthrough. I explained why I did every exercise. Honestly, not that well on triceps. Even if you don't use this exact workout, take some of the things that you might have learned and apply it to your own workouts. Because I know making your own workouts is a lot more fun than taking someone else's, at least in my opinion. So stay Swoley Moly, my dudes, and I will see you next time. Wop!